What's good, MABW team? What's going on today, MABW fam? I'm back today with another video. In today's video, money and relationships. For the most part, it's going to always be the downfall and why relationships end. Guys, I always tell you, these women out here, they need you some way, somehow to financially take care of them. And when there is a money problem, instead of being a woman, instead of being ladylike and talking to you or either leaving you alone because they feel you don't got it, they have to run to the internet to spew out all their problems to the world. Now, usually when women do this type of stuff, guys, listen to me well. They want a Captain save a hoe to step in and help them out. They want a man to get on the internet, either DM them or get in their inbox to let them know that they would have easily given them whatever they wanted. Once women get hits like that from certain men, they're going to end up leaving you alone. Guys, all you are, for the most part, to some of these women, and remember women, this doesn't apply to all women, but to the women that it do apply to, take it with a grain of salt. But to most of these women, guys, you are nothing but an ATM machine. I'm not going to talk no more. Let's get right into the damn video. All right, serious question, y'all. For people in a relationship, me and my boyfriend always get in a fight over money, bro. Okay, mind you, I'm not broke. Like, I, I'm, I'm not broke. I am broke right now. You feel what I'm saying? But I make good money is what I'm trying to say. And all my money goes into my bills. It's just after all my money goes into my bills, I usually have nothing left. So I pick. Let's stop it right there. If you're not broke, you would have at least a couple dollars to hold you over until your next check. If you're not broke, you're not going to get on the internet talking about how you're broke and complaining about what your boyfriend isn't giving you or what your boyfriend isn't doing for you. Let's let her tell it. I picked up three jobs, right? But my boyfriend didn't like that I was working the three jobs because he felt like I wasn't around my kid as much, which doesn't make any sense. But anyways, nevertheless, um, also um, I had to quit a third job because getting a sitter was becoming a little bit difficult because everybody started working um in the evenings so anyways me and him always get in an argument over cash and mind you i'm only ever asking for cash on my off days like if i'm paid i'm good right on my off days though i do be asking him for cash and i'm not talking about like hundreds of dollars i'm talking about 10 20 you know maybe 50 and it majority of the time it's to be put back into the house right or it's to be put to good use. Like, I'm not asking him to get my hair done. I'm not asking him to get my nails done. He doesn't even get any of that stuff done for me. Like, he does none of that for me. Like, if he does something for me, I have to ask for it. You feel what I'm saying? But I don't feel like that's right. And I get mad because every time I ask him for money, he wants to explode or have some type of reaction that just triggers me. And I just want to know, like, do you females ask your man for money? And how is that transaction like is it a fight is it normal to ask your man for money like how much money does he give you you know what i'm saying does he treat you to get your hair and nails done like my man literally does nothing but keep his money to himself like and it's annoying and he's very mr Krabs, and i don't like that and i don't know if that makes me sound shallow or whatever the case may be but no i i want to marry provider and i feel like providers you know will help out and also, he doesn't like to talk about his finances, bro. How are we supposed to be getting married in the future if you can't even have a simple conversation about finances with me? It's always turning into I'm being money hungry. Let's stop the damn video right there. He's a smart man. If you've been tuned into the MABW channel, you know that her boyfriend is a smart man. He doesn't tell her everything. She doesn't need to know nothing about his finances. Why do you need to know about his finances when you're broke? If she ends up knowing about his finances, guess what, guys? She's going to want him to do way more for her. Way more. He better not marry her. 
He better not marry her. Especially with her getting on the internet saying what she's saying to the world right now, he better not marry her. This will be a bullet that's uh, that he needs to dodge. So is she, she, she says she's looking for, for a provider. So is she not looking at her man like an ATM machine? Ladies, men don't owe you anything. I don't understand why y'all think just because men are saving their money, they're, they're doing what they have to do. They know how to uh, keep their money in their pocket that they owe you something. Y'all sit up here and y'all spend y'all money on the most bogus things. And then you expect your man to come in and save you and give you his money, give you what's out of his pocket. He doesn't owe you anything, nothing at all. It doesn't matter because you're his girlfriend. You're entitled to money just because you're a girlfriend. He has to give you money just because you're a girlfriend. Men don't owe y'all anything. And for some reason, y'all always think that y'all are entitled to what's in a man's pocket. And he doesn't like to talk to you about his finances. Good. Good. He's supposed to let you know everything he has in his account. What? I don't understand. You women ain't letting men know half of what y'all got in y'all account. And if y'all even did let a man know what y'all have in y'all account, y'all ain't going to give him nothing anyway, or y'all aren't going to give him nothing. So what does it matter? What does it matter? Y'all be wanting men to provide for y'all nonstop. And instead of y'all talking it out with that guy or just saying, you know what? He's not a provider or he can't do this. Y'all run to the internet. Y'all run to the internet. Hopefully her boyfriend sees this video and makes a very conscious decision in the future. And that conscious decision would be not to marry her because obviously she's all about him financially taking care of her. She's looking for stability from her boyfriend. That's all she's looking for. She's looking for her boyfriend to be the ATM machine when she's broke. How you got three jobs and you broke? Can somebody answer what, what how much are you making at the job? Eight bucks an hour at each job? What are you working total with all three jobs? Only 30 hours a week? How are you broke when you have three jobs? How would you own what is $20 gonna do even if he did give it to you? What is that really gonna do for the household? You can't afford to hold on to $20, but I can guarantee you. If that man needed anything, she would. Matter of fact, I'm not even going to say that because obviously with her working three jobs and being broke every week, she can't come through for him. So he needs to run because she obviously can't do nothing for him. Guys, what do y'all think about this video? Do you think that she's using her boyfriend as an ATM machine? Does her boyfriend need to know? To, to know. Does her boyfriend need to run? Y'all let me know in the comment section. Anyways, that's my video for today. If you like the video, of course, comment, like, and subscribe. It ain't costing you a damn thing. And of course, I'm going to holler back at y'all later. Peace.